Hello and welcome to That's The Point. My name is Corey Meyer. Joining me today is my tech buddy, Jeremy Horn. What's up? Hey, how's it going? You've been called worse. Uh, maybe. <laughs> so, today is the exact same goal as every other episode. It's construction technology, so away we go. Today we're talking about Trimble's two versions of FieldLink. One, FieldLink that you're already familiar with, most likely, because it runs all our total stations, our scanners. Um, the other side of it is less talked about, and that is specifically FieldLink, appropriately named Office. Yep. Um, so with the latest version of FieldLink, we're currently running 6.8 at the time of this video. Um, you have similar functionality without connecting to an instrument, but it runs on any laptop or desktop, right? So this offers some unique advantages. And the question we want to answer today is, should I be using FieldLink Office? And I think we do have an answer for that. You know, the main thing and the main one, uh, questions that we get and why they want to use it is the guys in the office want to be able to see what the guys in the field are seeing, right? Yep. So it gives them visibility into that. They can see the drawings as they're seeing them, see the points as they're seeing them, and also see the layout as it comes back, right? It leaves so, nothing to the imagination. If it looks like that in Fielding Office, it's going to look like that out in the field too. That's correct, absolutely. It also allows them to, you know, kind of be able to not only see what they're seeing, but adjust or fix anything that may be easier for them to do than the guys having to do it in the field. Right, and that, that goes to the next point, which is it's much more efficient and quick sometimes to do some things in a laptop. I mean, let's face it, like you're using a full-blown laptop with a mouse, some things are just faster than a tablet. Oh yeah, absolutely. <laughs> so, yeah, like we can create all the points we need, offsets, all that kind of stuff in the field on our tablet, not a problem. But if we're doing a lot of points, we're doing a lot of adjustments, using your finger, scrolling around, zooming like this is a lot different than me being able to use my mouse, uh, snap boxes, move around, that kind of thing. So yes, a guy in the field can, you know, definitely pass it off to a guy in the office if there's a lot of points to be made and, and that guy you know can do that and, and speaking to that speed and efficiency we've even seen some guys where the same field guy that's using the tablet actually has a field link office mm -hmm. license for his computer because he can go in the job site office and create some points very quickly and not be punching around on the tablet then transfer to his tablet and then go lay out right. Now there is one feature in Office that's not available in the traditional field link, and that is split stream functionality, right? That is something, because we have more screen real estate, it is something to keep, stay aware of that you get a little bit more information on the screen when you are in point manager, right? Well, yeah, and, and not even just point manager, but anywhere where we're going to input data, whereas in field link, you know, pretty much any time in field link, you go to one area, your whole screen then gets encompassed by. So if, I, if I'm going to point manager in this case, and I go to create a point, now you're going to see a split screen where I can still see my map. I still can even scroll around my map, but I can still also be inputting my data. Whereas on the tablet, as soon as I go to that edit button, my whole screen becomes that. And the last one is cost effectiveness. I feel like Office is a pretty darn good deal when it comes to being cost effective. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, $380 a year subscription, so you can it can be logged in, logged out, passed around. And, and that's where, you know, kind of even circling back to where, yeah, if, if you're the guy in the office and you want to see what your guy in the field is doing, it's not that expensive to be able to do it. Or if you're a guy in the field that you just need a little bit more horsepower sometimes to create your points instead of always having to do it on the tablet, again, it's not that expensive to add this in to be able to yep. do that. Yep. So Trimble has made a huge effort to kind of add these field link capabilities into Office. Um, so it's easier to bring that Office to field to Office workflow back again. It's definitely one of the kind of one of the tent poles that Trimble believes is that we have to have that good round trip data flow. And, and Office definitely speaks to that. And of course, if you need a subscription to FieldLink Office, reach out to your local building point representative and don't forget to smash that subscribe button. Stay up to date with all your latest tips, tricks, and pointers here. You made it. That was easy. It was like two minutes on the laptop. That was an easy one. You didn't even really need it. So <laughs> thanks for watching and we'll see you next time on That's the Point.